Human beings have always been dependent on animals such as cattle, birds, pigs, sheep and bees for products like milk, eggs, wool, meat and honey. With an increase in population worldwide, an increase in food production is also required. This can be achieved through animal husbandry and plant breeding. Animal husbandry refers to the practice of breeding and rearing livestock that are useful to human beings and includes cattle or dairy farming, poultry farming, beekeeping and fisheries. Plant breeding refers to the manipulation of plant species to create desired plant types that are better suited to cultivation, giving better yields and that are disease resistant. Did you know that India and China together contribute more than 70% to the livestock population in the world? However, as the productivity is very low, their contribution to the world farm produce is a mere 25%. To increase the overall quality and productivity of animal produce, Strategies and techniques to enhance food production need to be initiated along with proper management of farms and farm animals. Let us look at the management practices followed in dairy and poultry farms where traditional methods have been combined with innovative technologies to boost food production. Dairy farms rear animals for milk and milk products. The management methods used to increase production without compromising on the quality of milk is called dairy farm management. One of the key factors for increased milk production is breed selection. Good breeds have high yielding potential and high resistance to disease. Apart from the breed, proper sheltering, feeding and cleaning of cattle are essential to obtain high yields of milk. Sheltering involves providing a clean and disease-free environment with sufficient ventilation and water for the animals. It is also very important to keep a check on the health of the cattle through regular visits of a veterinary doctor. Their feeding is carried out in a scientific way involving the supply of fodder that is checked for specific quantity and quality. Cleaning the cattle and their shelters is also important to avoid any risk of germs and diseases. Apart from cleanliness, hygienic measures should be followed to keep the cattle and the handler clean. To avoid any contamination during milking, storing and transporting milk from the farm. Nowadays, with new technologies such as milking machines that are used to harvest milk, most of these processes are mechanized and the possibility of contamination is greatly reduced compared to the old method of milking by hand. In addition, the proper functioning of a dairy farm can be monitored by periodical inspection and record keeping. Just as dairy farms are used to rear milk yielding animals, poultry farms are managed to raise domestic fowls or birds such as chicken, duck, turkey and geese. These birds are reared for their meat and eggs. In fact, 
poultry refers to the meat of these birds and is sometimes used to denote the meat of all kinds of birds. Poultry farms also employ the management practices of dairy farming such as proper breed selection, shelter, feed and health care. Like milk, chicken and eggs are also consumed by human beings, which is how bird diseases spread to human beings as well. Bird flu or avian flu is a very common disease. If the chickens get infected by such diseases, they need to be properly culled and disposed of. However, ensuring proper hygienic shelter for the birds, nutritious feed and regular health care along with good quality breed selection will result in an increase in chicken and egg production. In this manner, proper poultry farm and dairy farm management along with strategies and techniques to ensure good yield and quality will help increase the overall quality and productivity of animal produce.